Don't get me wrong, baseball's had many a dumb play, from Niger Morgan spiking his glove following a missed catch leading to an inside the park home run, to Milton Bradley firing the second out of an inning into the outfield stands, to Jerks and Profar celebrating a single before even getting back to first base, allowing himself to get picked off by Yadier Molina in the process. But all these could be filed under a pretty typical mental lapse, right? While they might look goofy in retrospect, the reasoning behind them is pretty clear. But such was not the case for what I would consider to be the dumbest play in modern baseball history, when the Pittsburgh Pirates completely forgot how to play baseball. Facing Tyler Anderson in the top of the third inning with the man on second, Javier Baez got a fastball high and grounded to third base, where the throw to first would be a little offline, taking the first baseman off of the bag and towards Baez. He would then proceed to jog towards Javi as he backpedaled to the plate even though there was no pickle to be had, before inexplicably flipping to the plate, where William Contreras slid in safely, already by then netting the Cubs a run. Baez then started to go to first, where there was nobody covering, resulting in a throw that got away from the second baseman, allowing Baez to get up and go to second. Just look at the reactions of the Cubs players in the dugout, that tells you everything you need to know. It's hard to even go into the depth of how stupid this play is top to bottom, as you could easily fault the first baseman here for even engaging in Javi's games, then the catcher for signaling for a throw that didn't need to be made, then the second baseman for not covering the bag, and then the outfielder being way too far in on the infield allowing Baez to go to second. Basically everything that possibly can go wrong in a single play went wrong here, and route to the most mind numbing display of poor fundamentals we may have ever seen on a major league baseball field or at least in recent history.